Hey guys, RC here, back with some more Sim Airport. So I've built up a little more cash reserve. We're on day 38. Just taking a quick look, we have now picked up the perfect ops bonus. And this can go up based on your number of flights. So, but you can see at 36 flights, it topped out at 54,000. So hopefully we can keep this going. We've got our fuel in that we did last episode. I have also upgraded uh, the uh, airports, the airports, duh, uh, the, uh, the gates with fuel, and I have run uh, piping to all of them. And I've tried to stay as much away from the foundations as I can in case I need to expand those for anything. So that's what's going on there. Oh, here comes one of our big mamma jammas. Let's take a look at him. It's always good. So right now it says he'd have a 59% chance to refuel, but I don't have any gas yet. I don't have any fuel at the airport yet. Let's take a look at the passengers on a pause. Oh, they're in the gate. Okay, so we do have a handful of people. Why are they going? Did I misread that? That was gate, that was what, A3? Yeah, A3, so that's this one. So scheduled to depart at 9.30, he left at 8.05. And he had all of his passengers, so that's good. All right, so I guess that was okay. So let's see, let's catch up with today. So I've finished building this second level. So, I may have mentioned that you can get these people to take certain offices, but I also want to show you a new thing. Once you research it, uh, you have your, who is it, your maintenance, uh, your foreman, your foreman. Uh, you have this clone tool. So we're going to come in here and I'm going to clone this office with a door and we're going to bring that up to here. And I'm going to put that right there. Now, the other thing I'm going to do is then I'm going to come in and I'm going to make this an office. And you see these are larger offices, four by four. All right, now let's pause it. I'm going to go downstairs. So this is my CTO. That's my COO. My COO is the big one. So what I'm going to do is I am going to dezone that office okay so my CTO should come and take that office because it's the only office available and there you go he does so we're gonna do that again but in this this case I am going to come in and I'm going to clone his his office and we're gonna put that that and that while they're building it, then we're going to come in and we're going to zone all three offices. And then we're going to come down here and we are going to dezone my CFO and my finance VP. And then they should now be upstairs, which they are. All right. Then what I want is I want to clone this again. We're going to clone this office and we're going to turn it around. No, actually, I'm not going to do that then. So let's do, because I want to do this a little bit differently. We're going to go, he's going to be back in the corner here. And he wants, he needs windows, right? We need windows for him. We're going to go there and there. And we're going to put a door in right there. So they'll come take care of that. They'll get hardwood flooring in there. And did I make that an office? 
Well, I want to wait till the floors are done. Let's prioritize this one. Knock that out. I want to make sure that make sure I've zoned it in office before, and I don't think I have. So, yeah. So office. Nope, and then go back down, and my COO, we're going to unoffice her, and she should take the big corner office. Um, ooh, hold on, hold on. Nope. We want to delete that one. See, she took the first one I did, so you only want to do one at a time if there's a particular office you want. Come on. I may have to fire her. Oh, there she goes. All right. All right. So she's in there. Do I have another? All right. Where is my? Yeah. You know what? Our foreman probably deserves a better, a better office here. Because he is one of our key guys. All right, so then we're going to go back down up to our foreman. We will clean out his office, and then I'm going to dismantle. I could tear that wall down and maybe put another... another staircase or something possibly I can expand there later all right so now what I can do is I can re-office these so I've got four vacant offices so let's go in and hire four more sales reps and then I'm going to slow it down to speed one while we look at air airlines. All right. He's got a rep. He's got a rep. He's got a rep. They don't. Are we sure? All right. So here's our four new sales reps. So we'll start at the first one. Juno. Union Air, Starflight, Aerostar, Rex Canna. We'll assign them a rep. Atlantic International, Smart Air Lux. We'll assign them. Oh, we picked up we picked up some new ones here. So Galactic Point. So I don't have flights from them yet, and that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and assign them a sales rep so maybe we can start developing trust now. And then I am going to need one more office, aren't I? So I do have one here. So let's clone that. There. We'll plop that in. We'll make that an office, and then we'll hire one more sales rep. And then when he shows up right there, we will go to SparkJet and assign the last rep that we got. So there we go. All right, so we've got all those done. All of our main guys now have bigger offices. Uh, you know what? We can actually give them some windows as well. A thousand flights landed. Sweet. Didn't expect that. I was pretty sure I'd have this place bankrupted already. I wonder... Oh, one other thing that I did discover. When you're going into objects and uh, decor, uh, the plant, the bushes are good. They're 500, but these plants seem to do better. 
So I'm going to put... I'm going to put a plant in each person's office and uh, we'll let them build those and then we'll so oh the COO is very happy because he has windows so that's awesome so these ought to light up too once they have windows sure enough and then they should come and build the plants next I guess they're waiting for oh there we go boom all right, so now at least they're happy to be at work. The salespeople, like me, don't care about them. Just like in real life. Go out and earn us all the money. That's all we're worried about. All right, so we have sales reps. I've got some room for some more because we have two more airlines. Now what I can do here is we can also expand, say, build the visitors area here. And then... A conference room has to be what? Four by four. You know, we want nicer conference rooms, so let's plan it out. So we want a, we'll have a wall here, seven by six. We'll have a, a two wide hallway coming out here. And then we could do, another six by seven there with the hallway all right so we're going to build this out to there now we need a reception desk which we will face out that way let's do it this way and we'll put windows a window here actually you know what let's cancel that let's put a Let's put a sliding door. That'll be fancier. And we'll put a sliding door there as well. Um, the wall was already in place. Okay, that's fine. So we're gonna build a wall down the middle. And I tell you what, let's build a wall there. We'll move everything up one, and then this one will just be bigger. We'll have one larger and one smaller conference room. All right, we're going to clear out our planning here. That's fine. Uh, visitor's reception right there. And you know what? We'll put, we'll put a couple of benches in here. Don't know if we need them. Let's do that. And then we'll add in for decor. How about we'll put a nice little statue back in the corner. And we'll add in some of these plants as well. And we probably should have a garbage bin, maybe two of them. All right, so we'll hire a security guard for that spot. Even if we're not gonna use it, we're making enough money to afford it. So he'll be there. Um, I think we want, let's do this, carpet five. It's kind of a rich blue. And then we'll run that down the hallway. Yeah, let's just put that in all these rooms. We'll have a, uh, a large dark wood conference table in here. Do we want it that? Yeah. Let's put it there. And then we'll put a, uh, a glass conference table in this room. And then we want, I think these, these oh, hold on, fancy chairs. There we go.
There we are. All right, so we've got that. Then we will need doors. And we don't want glass. So let's put this one right there and right there. And then we'll zone these as conference rooms. All right. Oh, I can't rename those. That's too bad. All right. So we've got conference rooms, visitors reception, our security guards now there. We've got all of our offices assigned. We've got all of our airlines assigned. 93, 91. Looks like he's trending upwards. Trust is going up. 82. All right. 73, but his trust is going up. Definitely don't like the commercial fees. What are our fees? Yeah, that's uh, you're you're getting off light, dude. I think you're getting off light. Okay, we are about 18 minutes in. We've got our airport running smoothly on this end. So let's kind of rehash here. So you'll come in ticketing this these gates here. The gates that we have now, these four, will be serviced by these ticket booths. We know right now they are handling the flow and we're doing fine. So we want to kind of move into phase two of our airport. At least I do. So they'll you can come in here just like normal. And then you'll continue if you're not going into this terminal. You'll go down these escalators through here. And I think what we're going to do here is I'm going to put some kiosks in here. We're going to put a flight info kiosk right in the middle. Let's do it back to back. I'm going to put a health food kiosk. A snack kiosk, the dessert kiosk, and the coffee kiosk. We'll just have a kiosk section right here, right? And we'll put some flooring down. We probably want probably want tile here. Stone is stone more expensive? I think they're all fifty bucks. All right. We're going to floor that. And then I am going to put garbage bins up here. And then I think what I'm going to do is we will also add, let's do that. Because we're going to, we're going to kind of build this out as we go. All right. So one, two, three. put a wall we'll put a door here and a door here actually we cancel that and cancel that we'll do that in a minute well did it take the wall away it did so we'll build that I need to hire people but I'm gonna do that later all right I'm going to put a set of bathrooms here for people coming in. This will be our out of security bathrooms for the second terminal. And we're going to come into here. So in here, oh, this is going to be ticketing, right? Yes. Let me close that. All right. So what I've done in pre preemptive fashion, the, this is our up ramp to the baggage gate, right? So I have these two ports here. So we're, these will be, that'll be a consumer, and that'll be a consumer, and we are going to start to open this up. So what we're going to do is we're going to run the, the um, conveyors down here, right, into this room here. And this is going to be ticketing. 
Now, I need to figure where, all right, we know, we know we need to come down at least a good portion of the way. So let's start that. Oh, you know what? I actually wanted to try something. All right, let's do uh, conveyor down. Here and here, right? And then down here. And then we will want to have the conveyor down again. And we'll want these basically to line up. All right, so right there. And we're going to want to flip that. And I believe that is, yeah, that's separated. So we got to kind of, you got to kind of plan all this out as you go, you know? All right, so we're going to go here, and I, I got to see where the wall is going to be. And it is right there. So we'll connect that. And then we can dismantle this. So then what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to get our ticketing desks. Oh, shoot. I screwed up. No, no, no. This is okay. I can, I can still do something. Okay. So what we're going to want to do is each, each conveyor can handle five ticket desks. So we're going to go one... Two, three, four, five, and then one, two, three, four. Nope, we're not going to do it that way. It lines up a little differently because of the w way the uh, arrow is. All right, so we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. All right, then utilities. We're going to use this conveyor. Come up in to there. This one will run this way. That should work. That should work. All right, so we'll have five, we'll have 10 ticketing desks. All right, so we're gonna, this is gonna be our ticketing area right here. And what we're gonna also do is we will put in kiosks I think that's good we'll put in 12 of those that gives them through fare to walk now so again we're gonna have gates let me put in one gate because I can afford it. So we're going to put a large gate. What's the di what's the size difference? I'm going to line it up here. So it's basically that whole corner and then an extra large gate. Oh my god. All right. So yeah, we're going to go with the well, you know what? Let's go extra larges over here. How much are these? Sixty-eight thousand. All right. So we're going to put in. I'm going to put in two, but I'm only going to do one right now because this is going to be a low priority. Then I want to do construction. 
So we know, I, uh, hold on, yep, damn it. All right, well, actually we're gonna have to tear that out. So let's make it normal. I'm gonna have to tear it out because I can't build that close to the taxiway, which kinda sucks. So I'm gonna make this urgent. Go ahead and finish that, please. I was stupid. All right, foundation. See, I can't build up there, and you have to be able to cover that entrance. So I've got to be able to come in two spaces. All right, so we're going to build. I'm going to build that for right now, and then we're going to dismantle this. And I want that to be a higher priority. All right. Uh, even my grand granddaughters upset that I made a mistake. <laughs> All right, let's find that gate again. Now the good thing is we should. Well, we paid for it once, so we get a discount. All right, so we're gonna go there. That's better. All right, now how do I want to? All right, so there's. Um, so what I want to do is I want to have a wall in here somewhere and then have a, you know, hallway. It's kind of what I want over here. I'm just not sure how far out I want to go. Let's take a look. So certainly this is too narrow. One, two, three, four. That's five deep. I don't think that's bad just for your gate, but you can't have that be your hallway too. All right, so we'll let them finish building this. So let's pull out our planning tool. And I'm gonna slow it down so you guys don't have to see everything. All right, so I think we're gonna be, we'll have gate desks here. So I think I'm gonna wanna build a wall there right so i'm gonna want a little bit wider for that and then what we can do is we can put another set of gate another gate area and then more big more extra large gates on this side and they'll all service from this same terminal so you'll come up in here and then split off into your gate. You'll have seating in here. This will be all open. We could probably put uh, we could put a couple of stores at the end. So I definitely want that at least 12 wide, 11 wide. So five a wall and then five and a wall. I think that's what we want to do. Planned wall. All right. So if we do that, one, two, three, four, five. All right. So that could be a store, right? And then that would be a store, right? So we're going to want to spread our foundation out at least that far. And then what we could do is you'll have a two wide hallway. And then we'll have entrances in between into gates. So we could do a bathroom. We could do you know, some bathrooms up here, first class lounges, uh, flight crew lounges, all of that other stuff. I think that works. All right, what? I've done something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so kitchen, where are you at? Um, you know what? I'm going to do a separate kitchen for this area. Yes, because I don't want this. Oh, my God. All right. So we're going to go down a level. That goes up. So, yeah, I don't think we need a hub there because everything's just going to be going straight. So let's connect those. We'll make this a higher priority. 
and they'll work on that first. And then what I could do is dismantle all this. In fact, we're going to we're going to demolish. Well, we need to demolish it. We're going to demolish that. We'll keep that and then we'll demolish there. And then this can extend out to there. All right, well, so anyway, just to kind of remind you, all right, so what we're planning, they'll come in through here, down the escalators, through this food area, and we'll have bathrooms here. Let's go ahead and build those while I'm thinking about it. All right, then we're going to have uh, stalls. This one looks bigger. All right, so we're going to go. Do that. And then we'll put a door here. Okay, and we'll put a door there. Sounds so angry today. All right, four, and then we'll put urinals on the back wall for those. All right, I think that's good. So, and then this will be a female restroom, male restroom. All right, that'll be taken care of. So they can stop in the bathroom buy food, come down here, get ticketed. And this is kind of what I wanted to see. So here's our terminal coming in, right? So this is going to come back this way. So I think we're going to make this all security. I'm going to bring security all the way up. Well, we got 125,000, so I'm going to have to wait a little while. But we're going to put a big secure, you know, we'll put a little hallway uh, into a check area, then another little hallway into the main security, and then we'll have a huge security, you know, all the way up to, you know, all the way up to here, possibly. And, you know, probably, tw you know, 10 to 20 of those baggage scanners, and then we'll have. After you come out of security, we'll have an exit, turn left, an up ramp coming into the terminal. That'll bring us in up in here somewhere. We'll have, a, you know, we'll have multiple, um, probably three across, or two up, two up, two down escalators, something like that. But anyway, that'll have to wait for another episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what you think. And, uh, yeah, we'll see what's going on. I'll keep playing and try to build up some more money so we've got something else to do next time. Hit the like button. Subscribe. You guys are the greatest. Take care. Bye.